hi, this is Rebecca with Made Central, and in this video, we'll be going through the build highlights from Thursday, May 21st, 2020, and Thursday, June 4th, 2020. First up, technician check-in will always display the table of who is being checked in and out. So we can head over to our company general settings, and you can see here from our features tab that we have this give ability to check in additional employees enabled. So that means the box is gonna appear and I have the option to either check in my team members or not check in my team members. If this is disabled, it will work as always, show you the box and it will automatically check in all team members associated with that job. So I do have it enabled, so I'm gonna be logged in as a technician and you can see here, I'm gonna to go to my first job and when I click the check in button, I'm now gonna see this box and it gives me the opportunity to check in my teammate if they're with me or if they're not, I can leave this unchecked and not check them in with me. Next up, we also made it available for all users to be able to see the main and the sales dashboard. So office, um, your admins, your group admins and your sales employees can now see the main and sales dashboard, dashboard both. We also made it so that those same um, user groups can um, go to the invoice and they already have the ability to post credit card payments and now they have the ability to post check payments. So they'll see both of these options on the invoice tab or from the QuickBooks tab on the invoice. Next up, we updated the questionnaire so there's new COVID-19 questions, four new questions that are in line with what the states are asking people to be able to have an answer for. So you can see here that I've got this list of new questions that the team members can answer before they clock in for the day, as long as you make this active. We also made updates to the default schedule that's associated with the time span for the day for your technicians or office personnel. When you head over to an employee's account and go to their availability tab, you can now see the full 20 hours from 12 a.m. to 12 p.m. A great new added bonus that was added to our scorecard emails gives us the ability to see comments if the client leaves them within the first five minutes. So you can see here this scorecard was submitted and I now have a section where I can see the comments that were left on the scorecard from the email. To receive those emails, you would wanna to go to Company, General, and there's a section here that allows for you to enter multiple email addresses in order for you to get a copy of the scorecard feedback email. Another update that was added during the May 21st build was payroll summary will now include clock hours for a day, even if technicians did not work jobs and they do not have the hourly tag. I did a separate video for that, so please be sure to find that on the Made Central YouTube channel. And two new features included in the build that happened on the evening of Thursday, June 4th, 2020, were employee details and technician, including the PTO history. So this is a new feature that's been added. So you can see here, I am logged in as a technician. You can also see this internally as an office member, but I'm gonna go head over to my employee profile. It does require that I enter my password. And I'm going to go ahead and head over to my employee profile while logged in as a technician. And you can see here that I now have a new tab that allows me to view my PTO history. So by clicking this, I can see previous dates of when I used time and when my balance was increased and what, what activity has happened in the history with my paid time off. And the last feature added includes a new line item on my invoicing and job records page. This now will display the address to section in the description when you create your invoices. So this allows for you not only from this report 
to see which apartment or unit or suite number um, that is included in address line two on the customer's account, but it's also included in the description section of the invoice that's created by QuickBooks Online. And those are your feature highlights that have been added to the last two builds from Made Central. Thank you.